Quarter past the hour, welcome back to The Daily Buzz. In our head drama today, we are trying to find you some free time. Joining us is America's family manager, the author of 21 books, including the one on your screen, Kathy Peel. Good morning, Kathy. Good morning, great to be here. Good to be here uh, with you. And I, I gotta say, you know, when I was reviewing your stuff yesterday, um, I realized that my wife had started doing some of these things in our own lives, and they, I gotta say, they've had tremendous results. Um, now, you advocate running your family almost like, at least uh, time-wise, as a company, right? Well, the same strategies that run any business or organization well are going to help you reduce stress in a family. I mean, you and need free to... free up time. They will. They okay. really will. So take, for instance, mornings. Right. All right. Now, right now, people are shopping for school supplies. Yeah. And you're going to have the usuals that you buy, but pick up some inboxes. Okay. Just like you have inboxes at the office. You so need some at home. You need an inbox for your kids is yes. what you're saying. Now explain what you do with the inbox. Okay, each child should have an inbox and you start an SOP, Standard Operating Procedure, or just a routine. Right. Every afternoon they come in, they unload their backpacks and put important papers, forms to be signed, permission slips in their inbox. Then it's mom or dad's responsibility at night to go through, sign anything, and the kids reload those backpacks at night so you're not playing hide and seek with all the papers in the morning and running okay. late. Okay, uh, now create a control center. Yes, every manager needs a base of operation, okay. all right? It's your home, it might be the kitchen counter next to the refrigerator, or if you've got a desk in the kitchen, that's great. But you wanna have a message board there where everybody knows this is where all the information goes. Right. You wanna have a running grocery list, maybe a receipt, uh, envelope, and I always like to have a binder. You know, the kids get binders for school. Sure. I want a binder too, where I keep all the schedules, the homework guides and all that. It helps me keep up with information. Now this last one is something that my wife has started doing, which is using a timer. Yes, it's a cute little timer. This will help get kids going in the morning if you make it a challenge. And you might even uh, assign one child the, the, the uh, idea of being giving everybody a, a 10 minute warning. Right. And so, Right. You know, certain, their certain idea. tasks need to be performed within yeah. a certain time at certain times of the day. Yeah. But if you yeah. can have somebody give a 10 minute warning, that kind of gives everybody a heads up. Okay, 10 minutes, we got to walk out the door. And, and I can hear some skeptics in the audience maybe saying, well, this is too regimented for my family. But you know what, though? I've, we've started kind of employing some of this, and then that free time is all the more kind of free love and fun. Absolutely. Because you have those elements of your day that are regimented. Yes, and structure makes kids feel secure. Okay. And they like to be able to say, this is the way we always do it. More at headdrama.com. Yeah. you got to check it out, the Mom's Busy Guide.